happy earth day y'all today is earth day and i'm so mad because i was like dang i could have did me some earth nails but anyway um i was contemplating on whether to make this like a asmr like a little organizational video but i don't know i'm bored right now and i'm on break so i want to talk to y'all but I was just showing y'all my fingers, y'all. I got uh, two greenies. I got a couple of greenies on my right hand. So I just went on ahead and took my nails off. The other hand is fine. And don't worry if you guys get greenies. It is fine. Like your nail will grow out and you clip it off and it'll never come back again. I don't think it's a big deal. Um... But yeah, I was putting my clothes in the dryer and my pinky nail popped off. So I was like, okay, it's time to go ahead and take these off. Because y'all, that was the little almonds that I had on. And I look back on when I had first put those almonds on. I had had those almond nails on for two months, y'all. So those were like the same, basically the same acrylic. That was the same acrylic I had had on for like two months. But you know i was just changing up the like design on them and stuff like that but that was basically the same acrylic i finally found me some double-sided tape that actually works and sticks i got this off of amazon so i have been using this book and putting my little sets in there and but none of the tape that i was getting was working so i have all these sets i need to put in there and I was basically just using the other tape and literally having to line the entire page all the way down with the double-sided tape because it just would not stick. It was finally sticking after I had put tape all the way down. So, <clears throat> anyway, y'all, I'm at work on my break. It's so nice outside today. It's really pretty. It was cold this morning, but it's uh, warmed up a little bit out here in the shade but um anyway i'm trying to decide what i'm gonna do like with this book because i think i want to redo it over like i really think that i'm gonna take everything out and just do it over again because let's see after i put these in i still have like four more pages which if you do front and back that's eight more pages so I think what I'm going to do is, why is my son texting me talking about where's his keys at? I don't know where, he, how am I supposed to know where his keys are? Literally has not, I have not been bothered all day, but as soon as I get on here to do a voiceover now, all of a sudden, and watch, she finna call me in a minute, watch. So I'm finna transfer these on over here on this other side because that, um double-sided tape was not sticking but y'all i think what i'm gonna do is i think what i'm at first i was just gonna make this book like for all like my beginner sets so i could see where i came from type thing or maybe like i'll make like the first two pages like my my beginner sets like maybe my some of my like you know um favorite beginner sets but i really just want to redo this whole book and take everything out and like because y'all if y'all do this and y'all want it to look real nice and pretty and stuff just do one tape at a time like i was lining the whole page and then like sticking them down but some nails are longer than others so they was bumping into each other and stuff like that so if you really want them to look nice i say just you know do one at a time and put the nails on there that way you'll know like you know it'll just look better but I think what I'm gonna do y'all is um I'm gonna take all these out and I'm gonna keep the ones that I like the most and I'm just going to use this book for like my favorite 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 nail sets so that like you know if I have a client they can come over and they can look through the book and they can kind of like see my work so it'll kind of like be like a portfolio book you know what I'm saying something like that because i'm not going to keep keeping i'm not you know when this book fills up y'all it's gonna be it that's gonna be it i mean you can pull them off that's that tape is that double-sided tape is sticky and i was trying to decide how i was gonna put this one on because you know this is the thumb so you know when you show the thumb you got your thumb up so the cross is really 
upside down how I got it like that and it just wasn't sitting right with me how the cross was upside down but it didn't look right the other way so anyway I don't know I might take the cross off and glue it the other way because it just that just ain't sitting right with me with the cross being upside down so anyway y'all I'm just yeah I'm just cutting off you know the excess of the tip where it is up in the silicone hand and y'all let me tell y'all what I did with my silicone hand and I don't know if it's gonna work yet but I had tried to get some um I try to make my silicone hand look you know more expensive and make it look like darker in the knuckles and stuff like that so I had got some um what's this stuff called some uh I had tried this this stuff it's like this brow stuff that makes your brows darker like dyes your brows that didn't work so then I had tried some um some stain like some wood stain tried that that didn't work and I let it sit for a whole day the next day I had you know tried to see would it work it just peeled right off so I, I ordered me some hair dye so I'm gonna try the hair dye if the hair dye because I was thinking either hair dye or food food dye but if the hair dye won't work then the food dye probably won't work but I'm ha I have a good feeling that the hair dye might work so yeah I'm playing around with my silicone hair I'll probably do it on twin because you know she already messed up she done had surgery she got her thumb cut off and everything like she so I'll probably just use her as a little guinea pig to see if it works because I want to kind of like just dye you know some of the places on the hand and make it a little bit darker to make the hand look more realistic y'all know I'm always trying to do something to make my hands look more expensive or just try to do whatever I can before I actually go out and buy you know the real thing i'm gonna try to do whatever i can i'm gonna try to diy it as much as i can and see if i can make it work okay so anyway y'all um yeah and then i was putting these on they weren't sticking it was because they had so much oil on them from where i did the pop-off method and i put all that oil on there to pop them off and then i didn't even take the oil off so they were just sitting over there with oil on them and I had to wipe the oil off and then they stuck on good that set was so fun y'all and then my little candy set over there on the left that's my real that's real candy over there and it's still on there y'all I really think we can encapsulate candy like I didn't encapsulate that candy but that candy is still stuck on there as hard as a rock that candy is not moving I feel like the only way that candy going anywhere if I put it on some water like but yeah if I encapsulated that I think we could have really encapsulated we could really encapsulate some candy because that candy is not going anywhere a little crackle set over there so yeah and then too i like to have like a couple of sets in my silicone hands like around my room just like out for display and stuff like that but yeah i think i'm going to redo this book after i get me some more sets out you know um, since I'm getting a little bit better and stuff like that and try to make me some really nice sets and um and yeah I'm just gonna save this book for like my favorite sets there's a train y'all but um because I'm not gonna keep keeping I'm not I, I just I don't like clutter y'all I don't think that I am going to keep when this book is filled up I don't think I'm gonna continue I don't think I'll buy another book is what I'm saying. I don't think I'll buy like a second book and a third book and keep filling it up like that. I just don't think I will because I can always look back on Instagram. I can always look back on YouTube, you know, where, wherever I post my work and I can see, you know, I can see because I, I haven't deleted any of my beginner sets. So I can always look back and see where I came from. But so, yeah, I think I'm going to keep this book. Y'all see the little blunt back there. So yeah, I think I'm just going to keep this book for um for like my favorite sets as I go and then I'll just pull the ones out that I don't want and I probably just throw them away. Honestly, I probably just throw them away y'all cuz I just don't like clutter. So, anyway guys, yeah. Today is today is Earth Day. I might do some earth nails. I don't know. I wanted to do some earth nails for Earth Day, but I ain't have time. 
And then I'm mad because I ain't got no nails on. But I was like, I just need to go ahead and do this. Well, I ain't got no nails on. I'm going to go ahead and do my little book and, like, give my, my nails a break. But I do not like it when I don't have nails on. And I'm contemplating, y'all, whether do I want to just start wearing my nails again. Like, having both hands the same or, you know, having them different for content. Like, it's so hard to decide on what to do because I love wearing my nails and I don't want to sacrifice my own wearing my nails for doing content you know what I'm saying even though I don't want to do content like on my practice hands all the time so I don't know y'all it, it's so hard it's just because I want to keep having content for y'all but I want to wear my nails and I'm not getting enough clients right now like what the hell so anyway y'all these are are the sets if y'all want one of these books let me know i got the double-sided tape off amazon because that other tape that i was getting off timu and aliexpress and stuff like that it just was not sticky it just was not sticky girl so anyway you guys i will see you guys over on your video or i will see you in my next one love you guys see you in my next one Bye.